we have everyone that's part of Xanabrow and otherwise. Hello. And a newcomer, a newcomer. which we'll be playing spoilers, Daisy. Spoilers. And of course we have one of our primary villains. Well not not main villain, but you know side villain. I'm thinking shy guy. <laughs> and we have Tone and Ash and Darkling back here. And me, of course, uh, we just Brower and I just got finished filming the after credits scene for Smash Bros. Chapter 2. Spoiler. And yeah, let's get right into the questions. Alright, so from D Pro Prod. <laughs> okay, ready? Did you know Austin Stevenson, who played Brock, does comedy rap now? Wait, I don't think that's the question. That is the question. This is Q&A 6. Oh, I did not know that. See? That, there's an answer to your question. The I did not know that either. But guys, please leave your questions on on the actual Q&As, not the reminders. It, it's made much easier for us. Like, ah. Okay, anyways. Here are more of the questions. First is from... Will Metcalf, <laughs> who would win in a fight, Batman or Superman? Batman. 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 Who said Superman? Who said Superman? I don't know. The Flash. I don't know. Me. Power. <laughs> so here's here you go. Aquaman. Yes. Aquaman. Stop it. You have Batman, who actually studies the people he's about to fight. I he will the people find about to out fight. that Superman's weakness is, of course, Kryptonite. He has a utility belt which he can get kryptonite on and just throw it at Superman. Thank Boom! You. Fight over! Oh, yeah, bro. Superman! Oh. Um, moving on! We're Sponge. sorry. The SpongeBob SquarePants! I am very <gasps> sorry. Uh, the Vision. Cosmo. Now you're. Yes. Okay, oh, no. now. Okay. <laughs> oh. Ah! I don't want it! <laughs> From the Knife Stalker. You have five questions. Good, keeping it to that five question limit. Five. I like that. Can you count to five? Three. Pick number three, my lord. <clears throat> when will you guys start filming chapter three, and when will it come out? Will! Okay, so... Okay, so the answer to that is we're going to start filming it, hopefully by December, and we're releasing it in spring 2016. <laughs> when will Alan slash Ness return to Florida? Well, here's the Okay, thing. so the answer to that okay. is not never, because Alan's <laughs> probably not coming back in the show. Well, Alan's not returning in the show, at least as far as filming, but you do see Ness in something. Spoilers. Well, <laughs> we don't know, because he never said if he would return. That is why... We killed him off in episode 14, as you've seen. I thought we thought he was an asshole. <laughs> well, what's yeah. that? Well, I mean, why else did we kill him off? <laughs> we killed Ness off, he but he, he is in a special... Uh, he is in a special afterlife scene in chapter 3. So he is in all three <clears throat> chapters, but we don't know when he's actually coming. Will Kirby or Lil Mac make an appearance in question 3? Huh? In question 3? Um, right? the answer to that is no. Lil Mac, we ha we had him. Yeah, I know. In chapter in chapter one, we had Little Mac for some time because you know it was final. But then our actor, he's gone busy and stuff with life in general, so he can't return. Plus, we decided it was a good send off that he already had. Kirby, we just wanted to have a small little cameo. That's it. Done. No, nope. the makeup is horrendous for Kirby. Horrendously difficult to do. It's just pink. Pink. It's not oh, just pink. Her. It's never just pink. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. A little red too. Plus, Little Mac is the one that owns that pink sweatshirt, and we. And didn't yeah. Little Mac move or graduate? Question number four from Knife Stalker VA. Who is your favorite Pokemon and why, Will? My favorite Pokemon is uh, Pikachu. Jenny. Lady Heather. I don't like Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Will. Patrick. <laughs> Lucario. Espeon! And I'm of course, so of course, me, Charmeleon. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> what am Charmeleon. I doing here? Explain. <laughs> You're just you finally Mario. answered the question. Uh, you finally broke in your Q&A cherry. You, you popped your Q&A cherry! I did not too! No one cares yeah. about you. So, question number five. What, from, your, from the Knife Stalker, what is your favorite movie in the Marvel comic book universe cinema series stuff? And why? Excluding Avengers, Avengers, the first one, is not included. Alright, uh, well, mine from now, it will have to be 
Guardians of the Galaxy because it has that comedy feel but also serious superhero feel, meaning a brand new cast. So, yeah. I would have to say it would probably be Iron Man just because he's so sarcastic and I love him. Or? Thor because abs. I would also have to say Guardians of the Galaxy. I just like, uh, oh, I like them before in the comics, and um, the fact that such like small characters got such a big movie, and it was awesome with an awesome director. Yeah. I'm gonna have to say Iron Man. You know, that movie is one of the major starts to the MCU. Also, Iron Man is fucking badass Tony Stark. Oh my god. He's just so fucking hot. Two for Guardians, two for Iron Man, one for Thor, and what's your vote, Will? Thor. For me, it's a tie between Guardians and Ant-Man. Mm. Ant yeah, Man. because Ant-Man was cool. Oh, yeah. Ant-Man Ant was amazing. Ant-Man was amazing. I so don't have to see it. It's a, it's a t for me, it's a tie, because Guardians, <laughs> it, they really did a great thing on Guardians, and Ant-Man, I I just loved it. It was a great introduction of Ant-Man. So, yeah. Now, who is your favorite Avenger and why? Throw up! My favorite Avenger is now. This is just the Avengers of the main five, not the <laughs> not the B team from Age of Ultron okay. or any or anyone else or any other superhero um, that's been introduced. Just the Avengers. Probably Thor because he got shit done. Abs. Iron Man. Thor. Abs. I might have to say Hawkeye just because he clearly points out all the shit that happens and just gives no fucks. We finally like you, Hawkeye. Oh, Hawkeye, good for you. We like you now. Try it on the refrigerator. I'm gonna say Black Widow. She's a badass. And boobs. Boobies. Boobies. I'm going to have to say Iron Man because. I just love him. He's always I loved so him in which was that movie. I actually enjoyed him in um He's the OG Avenger. <laughs> no, that's Captain America. Oh, yeah. right. Captain, yeah. His name it's literally his title. Captain America, the, the first, first Avenger. Avenger. Smirk! Well, Iron Man is the first OG movie Avenger. Smirk! Uh, uh, you, you he's not far off about that. I thought Hulk was! Hmm. Alright. That was the last few questions for Life Soccer. Now for Zayda's Films, you have one, two, three, four, five. You have six, but we're going to make an exception because there's no one else after you, so it's okay. So for Zayda's Films Network, question one. Are you seeing Star Wars 7? Hell yeah. No shit, Sherlock. Maybe. Maybe! Okay. Damn straight. The corner you go. It's as long as Darth Vader is still a Sith, I'm still gonna be fucking watching this. He's dead. You can be Sith when you're dead. Just He's look, not a Sith. Just he, look at him. He redeemed her. himself at the end of episode six. He wow! Was, yeah. It looks like I'm not seeing Star Wars episode seven. <sighs> I'm no, kidding. No. Oh, oh no. no, my dear, I can't. Well, okay, hey. I'm seeing it, yes, because honestly, <laughs> it looks like they're returning to the roots of how they made the originals using models and shit. And I'm, I have good faith in I have good faith in J.J. Abrams. However, if he does mess up, we will be calling him Jar Jar Abrams. That's <laughs> if he messes up. I'm waiting for Harrison Ford. Chewie, Chewie we're back. Oh my back. Ah, Chewie. Chewie. Question number two from Zayda's Films Network. XFN. Okay. How many more Mario projects are you going to make? Well. In Louis, the la- uh, 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 oh, <laughs> slow down! <laughs> After Smash Bros, of course, Chapter 3, you know there's going to be a Luigi Chronicles. That's going to be the final official ending to the entire Young Mario Brothers saga. We're so we think. <laughs> Shut up, Will. It is the ending. If you even try to reboot it, I will come to wherever you're living. I will rip your balls off, implying you still have them, and I will hand them right to lovely Heather over here, whether she's with you I'll or not. I'll make earrings out of it. Exactly. 
So yeah, there's gonna be no re there's no bringing the Young Mario Brothers back after Luigi Chronicles. That is confirmed. Done. 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 So the last one, as far as Young Mario Bros goes, is Luigi Chronicles. However, Broward might be doing some side things. I might be doing some side things. These fine people might be doing. I don't know. It's just whatever. Spoiler alert! My comment might become a movie for these people. That doesn't relate to Mario. <laughs> Uh, I might one day in the future make a code series, but I, it's pretty certain uh, none of you people will be able to come back. I don't even want you. Nothing against you, just the story. Nobody has likes none you. Of your character. You guys suck. Nobody likes you. <laughs> Sit down. I'm just a side character who finally got the promotion he deserves. To main villain. Okay, question number three from XFM. <laughs> Do you think the Plumber Night Return Season 2 will ever happen? Yes, but I'm not looking forward to it because I just kind of gave up and I just don't care at this point. I don't even know what that is. It's Rich Alvarez. I'm just watching it because it's my childhood. <laughs> and maybe it will happen coming soon. Never liked it. Coming soon in the year 2035. Sit down, you. Yeah. Do you even know what Plum Night's Returns is? <laughs> no. Okay, so that's a no. Um, so yeah, that's one yes, and the rest is just real give a fuck. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> You're outnumbered here. I'm sorry, Rich Alvarez. It's okay. I'm not hating on the guy, I'm just, I'm not. We'll still be friends I'm sure you make very lovely content, I just don't watch it. We're, we'll still be friends on Facebook. Really? Yeah. Alright, oh. next question, number four from XFM. Who are your favorite youtubers? Because the U in the YouTube is it, it's a channel. The YouTube channels. <laughs> Who are your favorite YouTube channels? As of right now, it's a time between Rich Alvarez and Nika Hika. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Nika Hika. I knew it. Storm FX3. Amazing Atheist. Yeah. Yeah. Doctor Who that's trailer. Uh, that's our YouTube channel. <laughs> uh, yeah, I really just like whatever I come across. BBC. That, I mean, that's fair. Okay. Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, and uh, the League of Super Critics, or whatever they're doing, right? Now. Sure. <laughs> oh, and um, how it should have been. Man. I don't have a favorite. I'm like Patrick here. I just enjoy whatever I find. Yes, I have ones I enjoy more than others, but I'm not picking a favorite here because, you know, yeah. I like, I choose videos, not channels. Next question. Um, okay. From XFM. Did you see the Smosh movie? Oh, and are you still fans of Smosh? Brower and I have both seen the Smosh movie. Brower and I actually better than, a lot better than the friend movie. It has a plot. And the it doesn't, friend movie what? doesn't exist. What? And it doesn't have John Cena in it either. It has a plot. And other YouTubers. I enjoyed it. I actually enjoyed it. And the I liked the cameo, especially Jenna Marbles' cameo. That was very nice. I liked it. And it has those old-fashioned smosh effects from 2006. <laughs> yes. Aww. Now, okay. Um, how about other... Uh, anyone else here see it? I have not seen the movie, I don't but... Like smosh. She hates smosh. I, I like, I like I smosh, I just haven't seen the movie yet. So. Okay, so you're a fan. You're not a fan. You hate them. You want to just sacrifice them to your vagina. Yes! <laughs> Patrick! I've never Patrick. actually ever seen Smosh besides that one time on, on Epic Rap Battles. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, when they were the um, artists. Yeah. Versus the one of the best episodes, by the way. That was amazing. Yeah, I that loved was, it. That was actually funny. Mm -hmm. We actually really? watched yeah. we watched it in art class um, yesterday. It was fun. Hmm. Yeah, we were, yeah, we were watching Epic Rap Battles of History in art class. <laughs> uh, you a fan? Oh, hell yeah! They're one of the first people I ever subscribed okay, to. Okay, preach, preach to the choir. Preach to the choir. I, I just, I used to be a fan. I, I, you know, I just, their videos have, it's be, it's not their fault. But this guy over here plays them nonstop, so I'm just gotten sick, sick of them. Of I've gotten I can sick. I respect both Ian and Anthony because there's, I, I'm totally fine with their content. It's just that this guy ruined it for me. <laughs> Last! And final question of Q&A number seven! Last question. Any new updates for Luigi Chronicles? This is my time to shine. My time to shine. Your time. My time. Okay. Time. Yes, there are updates for Luigi Chronicles. The update is... <gasps> it's coming out 2017. In all seriousness, though, big update for Luigi Chronicles is that all the footage you have seen... Yes, those scenes are still, for the most part, in it. Some of them, some not. The reason, but I'm going through the script and I'm changing a lot of things. So a lot of it is being refilmed. 
That's why you haven't really been seeing anything, because I'm refilming a lot of it. Because I'm rewriting a lot of it, because... Yeah, when you write Actors. a script and then you get an idea, it's not really... Well, the acting thing, that's easy. It just replace well, one yeah. character with another. It's both <laughs> cases, you know? But, um... When you're writing and then you get a brilliant idea, that brilliant idea breaks the continuity of the previous things, so then you have to go rewrite everything just to build up to that. It's kind of like what they did with Frozen. They made Frozen, they wrote the song Let It Go, and then they rewrote all of Frozen just to go around that song. So it basically, Frozen is just a giant, just a giant build up to Let It Go, and then the rest of it you just yeah, whatever. Yeah, the rest is like, oh, yeah, well, yeah. The, the YOLO song! <laughs> Okay, but, um, yeah, basically it's just, you know... The I'm re- Look out for the Toe comic. Toe, yeah, no, but I'm Patrick Robinson. Oh, crap. I, I, you talked! You must come in here! Uh, little joke, but there is actually a, uh, there actually will be multiple stories that take place after... Smash Brothers and Gorgeous. before Luigi Chronicles, uh, that will chronicle Toad's career. How is that happening? Whatever. All right. Anyways, that's the end of QA number seven. Woo! If you still have your hearing and/or sanity after that, well, good on you. Otherwise, I'm whatever. Now. Stay tuned for a new.